Hey Hope, uh, good Friday to you, May 6th, hope you're doing well, and uh, you're looking at a blank screen, I know that because really, to be honest with you, there's no need to, um, um, to put any words up here, I mean, you've already turned your review sheet in, that's good, you have no incomplete, so that's good, so really, all that you're going to do today is take a test, alright, so, I have the test here in my hands, at this time, please pause the video, get a copy of the test, and restart the video once you have a test in your hands. Okay, number one, we're going to write a factor as an ordered pair. Number two, we're going to add and multiply factors. Um, don't forget, there's a special way to multiply. It's called the dot product. Please don't forget that. Number four, use the dot product to show whether or not the um, two factors are perpendicular. You must explain. Read the question carefully, help. Number four, you must explain how you came to this conclusion. Numbers five through eleven, use that figure above that to um, list out um, some different parts. Now number five says name a segment. There are tons of segments up there. Um, parallel to each A, okay? You only need to name one, okay? So there is more than one answer to a lot of these blanks. Now number eleven. Solve that linear system by a method of your choice, okay? You can use linear combination or graphing or substitution. Numbers 12 and 13, write a linear equation for a line that has those characteristics. Numbers 14 through 17, we're going to use that figure up above. We're going to name a pair of angles um, that um, I ask you to name there in those problems. Numbers 14 through 17, so read those and you'll be fine. Number 18, proof theorem 3.6.